Rapid City Area School Board sat down with community members yesterday to talk about a district wide problem, the student achievement gap. As our Humberto Gila Sanchez explains, the school board heard feedback given by community members and figured out ways to work alongside them and the students as well. Achievement gaps. These occur in school districts when one group of students tends to outperform another by a significant margin. And in the Rapid City Area School District. Truly, across board, our college and career readiness numbers, and to be honest, are not good. They're 44%. Those numbers helping push RCAS to come up with ideas alongside community members in order to target those areas of need. And from Tuesday night's community forum, one of the areas targeted was early education. When I was teaching second grade, I would have multiple students come to me who had never been in school before, and the difference between kindergarten and second grade is huge. So we need like a catch-up program for these students who have never been exposed to any content before. But this wasn't the only topic. Conversations about Native American students' achievement gap in the district were forefront. From what can be done to help them to what needs to be done to begin closing the gap while making sure that no boundaries are crossed between the personal life of the student and school life. There's things that are, are beyond our beyond what we can do, or what, what we're set, uh, sent to do, but we can find partners within our city to help do that. So I think that's important. While multiple things stood out at the forum, a key talking point throughout the night was letting students' voices be heard. We should be asking students these same questions because students have just the same amount of power and can give solutions to the problems that are in the schools because they live it every day. RCAS said the outreach forum is only one of many steps trying to figure out how the district can solve the problem of the achievement gap between students and aims to continue working with the surrounding community for the betterment of those students' education. Reporting in Rapid City, I'm Humberto Giles Sanchez.